importance of steam operation was the use of Gresley's legendary A-4s on the three-hour Glasgow to Aberdeen expresses. This Indian summer gave them an extended lease of life after being declared redundant on the East Coast route south of Edinburgh. By the summer of 1964, seven were back in traffic operating on the former Caledonian route from Glasgow to Aberdeen. This took them north from Perth and then along the fast main line east from Stanley Junction via Forfar. This was a fitting epitaph to a magnificent design. On the section from Aberdeen to Stonehaven, they were one and a half minutes quicker than the 2,000 horsepower diesel electrics. In 1966, or the last of the A4s in daily service. 27 years later, one in the shape of 6 treble 09 Union of South Africa was to return, once again leaving Perth on a daily basis. For a total of eight weeks in the autumn, a series of crew training runs were to be made from here to Glasgow along the former Caledonian main line. This was a similar operation to the runs by Standard Tank 80080 on the Carlisle to Appleby line in the spring. Tickets at 15 pounds a head were offered to those wishing to travel on the five-hour out-and-back journey. This was very much a revenue-earning run and offered superb value for money. Six Treble 09 is climbing the short grade to Hilton Junction, from where the train will head west for its first stop at Glen Eagles. section of mainline. Semaphore signals, long clear vantage points and fine scenery set it apart from many other main lines. were incidentally due to have been undertaken in the period from the 18th of June. Unfortunately, a footplate accident caused their postponement. Next comes Sterling and a stop for water. Brunswick Green Survivor revives memories of an Indian summer for Scottish steam. 